Welcome to Translogic. I'm Jonathan Buckley. I'm gonna get embarrassed by a robot. Oh. Holy shit. <laughs> Well, it's been a pretty stellar year for Translogic. We came, we saw, and we drove. Like usual, Tesla was part of the mix, as were autonomous vehicles. Drones, robots, and hoverboards made some appearances, and we even encountered a few zombies. Oh my gosh. What have I gone and got myself into? <laughs> First off, straight out of the gate, the 68 Fastback is one of my favourite classic cars. Something about old school American muscle just really gets my blood pumping. But then when you take two electric motors in this case at it, producing 1,800 foot pounds of torque with 800 horsepower, and you've got something really, really special. This car was designed with one thing and one thing only, and that is sheer speed. A zero to 60 time of 1.94 seconds. Here we go <laughs> with the world's quietest burnout. <laughs> oh, and it's still going. Oh, this thing just wants to spin and spin and spin. <laughs> that was fun. You're looking at around about a 500 mile range, which is going to be good to get you out of the city centre in an emergency. What Insane Mode does essentially is gives you all of the power that this car has to offer. It doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to be draining the battery faster if you're just driving around in this mode. You can leave it in Insane Mode and have that ready to go whenever you like it. Let's see how it feels. <laughs> That's incredible. You can feel it in your chest more than anything. I've driven a lot of fast cars, but because this car has all-wheel drive and it's all torque, you just get this punch that just has left absolutely everybody else for dead. But I feel like it's kind of rude for me just to experience this all by myself, so maybe we should give the crew a ride. And then, did you see that? <laughs> wow. I'm not that much of a car person. Was really... Oh my god, that's fast. <laughs> it's kind of nice that Ford are so concerned about the well being of their employees. I wish the same could be said for the producers at Translogic. Here we go, tabletop man. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Who's Bobby? Well, Bobby's this guy. Well, I've got to say, like, from the get-go, I'm a pretty bad passenger normally, let alone when the car is driving itself like Bobby is today. So what do we have to do here? We will go for a piloted drive. Yeah. And we don't have to do a lot uh, because we're just passengers. Come on then, Bobby. Show us what you got. Oh, nice work, Bobby. Oh, I like it. He clips the corners of the chicane, just like I would. I'm a little bit nervous that I might not be able to beat him. So what he knows very well is the line yeah. and also the braking point, as you already realised. Braking points He there. breaks comparatively late. He does, doesn't he? Wow, I think he's, like, clipped the cones. Bobby's out of control. <laughs> but he never touches the cone. We have never, ever thrown one off. So now it's my turn, yeah? Now it's your turn. <laughs> I've got to say, well played, Bobby. And we're off. First you can. I can't 
can't help but feel like Bobby was a little bit more composed. Whoa, into the dirt there. Oh, here's the fast part straight away. Fifth gear, hold it through the corner. Uh, hard on the anchors. Come on, Buckley. Oh. Do you think you were faster? Well, this is the thing. I was on the ragged limit. So if Bobby's beat me, then I've got to give him massive kudos because I couldn't have gone any harder than that. OK, OK. Uh, no, actually, you've done the best lap time today. Really? And you did two minutes, six seconds, point yes. two. Yes! <laughs> Congrats. I'm so happy about that. <laughs> What have you got to say to the people that think that robots will take over the world? <laughs> You've seen the robots? They're slow. <laughs> they fall down. We have a long, long, long way to go. So I tell you, you don't have to worry, at least yet. Your car actually flies, doesn't it? Right, our car will float. I mean, when we designed this, it was just sort of our fluke of engineering. We actually pronounce it McMillian. McMillian? McMillian, not McMillian. McMillian? McMillian. 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 McMillian? <laughs> McMillian. 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 Yeah. McMillian. McMillian. Thank Did you, sir. Right? McMillian. Better. Welcome to Translogic's very first virtual reality test drive. Now, if you're new to this kind of business, first thing you need to do is to start to look around. So look up, look down, look to the left, to the right. We've got a full 360-degree view. The track we've come out to is the Horse Thief Mile. It's out in California at Willow Springs Raceway. Take a look out the window. Beautiful scenery, and we even took the top off for you so you can take a look up at the sky. Unfortunately, the year is coming to a close, but fear not, we'll be back all revved up and ready to go. Translogic, I'm Jonathan Buckley. We'll catch you next time. <laughs>